Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. We just got out of watching Disney's Haunted Mansion. And these are just our straight out of the theater thoughts. We have seen a Haunted Mansion, the one with Eddie Murphy that came on like in 2003. Honestly, I'm not really a big fan of it. It's not one that I tend to watch during spooky season. The Disney ride, I really, really love. I don't remember it really that much because it's been like 15 years, I think, since we last went to Disney. <laughs> but I remember really loving the ride. So I really liked it. I liked all the little spooky It's like how some of the ghosts wanted help but then also like manipulated everything looked really cool all those cobwebs everything all that it's very funny how they didn't really react to all the cobwebs how, how would it have been like <laughs> i think once you live in a house with so many ghosts the cobwebs are yeah. least of the worst but maybe? whenever they first got there you know the kid just like that's kinda, true just that's turn on true. the light without even looking at anything yeah. he just like the ghosts were really cool. I liked how they like kind of like. Mm -hmm. They were very ghostly. <laughs> yeah, they, yeah, they were very ghostly. I thought it was really cool that they would literally attach them themselves and make them come back. Not too many spoilers. Not too many spoilers. That's it. That's <laughs> it on the spoiler. Everything looked really cool. I really like all their like acting and all that. It was. It was very funny. So yeah, I really enjoyed it as well. I honestly didn't expect to like it as much as I did. Just given the fact that the first one I wasn't really a fan of. This is definitely the version that I would be re-watching. Um, it's kind of strange that they ended up bringing it out in July. I think that this movie definitely would have been more of a spooky season kind of. Maybe like late September or of course in October. I think it would have given uh, better vibes. I mean it's not Halloween. No, they have a Halloween moment in the movie there at the end. Mm -hmm. So it would have been like great to kind of have that moment there. It's a great family friendly movie. This could literally be an introduction into horror movies because there are a few like little jump scares. There are a few kind of like really creepy ghosts. Um, right off the bat like when we get into the house there's this very like scary ass like woman mm -hmm. ghost that she creepy as hell and she pops up throughout the movie so it does have some creepy kind of scary moments that be wary of for the young ones if you are coming with the family as an adult yeah no i don't fuck with scary movies but i was I was good with it you know some of it kind of like did creep me out a little bit stop <laughs> <laughs> did creep me out a little bit but nothing that i couldn't handle but of course for like little little kids just because you know the cgi special effects the uh, practical effects um they're really really good so just kind of pre-worn um on that end the cast was absolutely great i loved everybody i think everybody did an amazing job um for the standout lakeith for sure and i loved owen well, damn it, i love all of them i can't even say like i love i think rosario dawson was probably my like besides the kid rosario D dawson would be like down there at the at the at the bottom but you gotta say you know what's color people you know we smart because as soon as that shit went down it's like fuck this shit we out of here i mean like desiree said the house brings you back but we ain't about investigating shit we ain't gonna be like oh what the fuck is this very very surprising honestly I, I like i said i didn't i went in with low expectations and i was pleasantly pleasantly surprised by it i definitely think it is a great movie to come and check out with the family you know right before the kids start school i love the message overall message grief we touch on grief so if that's something that you as a family don't want to introduce to your kids then maybe not 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 a movie for you guys it doesn't well yeah there, there's like really emotional parts um i feel like if i was a little bit more invested in the story i think i would have got a little bit more sentimental but it did have sentimental parts in it and then we immediately get it with like some very funny parts there about like oh you're definitely gonna kind of go <laughs> uh but again it's a nice little mixture we got some spooky stuff we got some heart we got family stuff we got funny stuff we got dramatic stuff with drama in there i don't think drama was in there but yeah um if you haven't already give this video a like comment subscribe what you think about it what you think about this one versus the one from eddie murphy again that i'm not i mean if you love that one great if you love that one i feel like you're gonna absolutely like love this one because like that one mm, not for me but with all that said what are you gonna rank it medium 
yeah, I'm gonna give it a medium as as well. When I would definitely rewatch. But that's it for us today. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, we'll see you guys at concessions. Bye. <laughs>